Hi, I'm Chuck at Inline2, and today we're going to show you how to seat a brake line. The tools needed to seat the brake line are a line wrench and a deep well socket. First, remove the line and inspect the cone at the component. This cone should have a ring crushed into it all the way around. We refer to this as a witness ring. If the ring does not go all the way around, the line is not centered. Notice the difference between the two photos. On the left, you can see a properly seated witness ring. On the right, you can see an incorrectly seated witness ring. To ensure that the line is properly seated straight into the hole, we recommend using a deep well socket. Place the deep well socket over the very end of the tube's hex fitting and slightly bend. Now that you have inspected the line, clip it into place to ensure that it doesn't move. Next, slide the tube nut back out of the way and hold the flare to the cone. When you let go, it should stay centered. If it does not stay in place, continue to make slight adjustments until it will stay centered without your help. With the flare on the cone, slide the tube nut up and tighten with your fingers. Now that the nut is finger tight, use a line wrench to tighten the nut snug, then half turn to seat the flare. Next, loosen the tube nut and repeat this process. Each time you tighten with the wrench, add a half turn more. The tube nut should go a little further each time. Repeat this process four times, loosening and tightening. After the fourth time of tightening, snug the flare to the cone with your line wrench. You have now created a perfectly centered flare seat and the line should not leak. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns regarding any one of our 30,000 products, please visit us at www.inlinetube.com to speak with an expert. Feel free to leave a comment below of any future videos that you would like to see.